All right, so we're here at the Artist Retreat at Azul for Resources for Social Change. So tell us your name, first name, and if it's okay if we put you online, your comments online. Yeah, it's fine. Leandria. Great. So at the end of his life, MLK dreamed of an end to poverty, militarism, and racism. So what do you expect of elected officials to reach this dream? Who? um... I don't have too much of a take when it comes to elected officials, but I do hope that they put the people first, um, and I'll leave it there because I don't. I, I kind of stay out of politics, but I feel like in any sort, be it local or government officials, you should definitely put your community, your people first because they're the ones that have to live each and every day based off of what choices they make because they kind of have the final say to me. That's my choice <laughs> and my thoughts. <laughs> Thank you. And what are you doing in your community? In my community, um, I have really taken to the youth and um, have given back through the arts by um, bringing youth of all creeds, sex, gender, whatever you want to call it, and um, brought them together to a place where they can voice their thoughts in the world and unify. And um, we do that through unity, through poetry, and um, we've done events that reach out to the community. Um, we've done a lot, and I feel like for when I when I think of myself, it's not just me. I feel like it's a collective. It's what I can do with other people to get um, us to uh, interact and to bring peace among everyone. And um, that's pretty much it. Thank you. That was like so hard. <laughs>